Yo, what's good guys? It is Riley and welcome back to another Road to Dark Matter video and I got the M16 video for you guys today. If you watch my AUG video and you saw the clips and the gameplay in that video, this video is extremely similar. This M16 is absolutely broken. It's just like the AUG in terms of how it feels on Cold War. You can get consistent one burst with this class setup I'm going to show you guys and it's just broken to say the least as usual i'm going to show you guys the clips and then i'm going to hop into a 108 kill gameplay i got on nuketown i finally broke 100 kills i actually got 100 kill gameplay and then 108 kill gameplay a little bit later on so i'm showing you guys the 108 the clips i have for you guys are insane as well i get a bunch of kill chains i get a bunch of quad feeds quad feed times twos pick up gun clips get a i think i got a quad feed and then i picked up a mp7 or something and got two more it's just crazy the clips i'm going to show you guys this class setup's absolutely broken using the spaz as my secondary running in the house getting a kill chain you guys are going to see those clips in a moment but yeah i'll talk to you guys later on in the video after the clips and then i'll be showing you guys the class setup Yo, Riley, are you gonna put that in your YouTube video? Oh, my gunship in there, you fucking loser, with your M16. Let's go, that's a kill chain. Easy kill chain. All right, guys, here we are over at the class setup portion of the video, and I'm just going to hop right into it. This is the best M16 class setup for getting consistent one bursts and absolutely just destroying lobbies. For the optic, I like to rock the mill stop reflex. I was going between this and the quick dot LED, but I think the mill stop reflex is a little bit cleaner, so I run this. For the barrel, I rock the 15.9 inch strike team. This gives us damage and fire rate. This is the attachment that's going to help you get the one burst I was mentioning. Once you unlock this, you unlock it pretty quick. You'll be on to shredding and just destroying everybody. For the underbarrel, I rock the field agent foregrip. This just gives us vertical and horizontal recoil control. For the mag, I rock the 45 round speed mag. I just feel like it's the best option. I don't find myself needing more ammo than 45 and I like to reload quickly. So this is the go-to for me, the 45 round speed mag. And lastly, for the stock, I like to rock the Raider pad. This gives a sprint to fire time and some aim walking movement speed, just so when you're ADSing, you can still have a little bit of movement and be able to pick up some kills. 
And that's gonna do it for the class setup portion of the video, guys. I would recommend rocking this M16 class. You're gonna have a blast with it. It's absolutely broken, like I've been saying this whole video. I honestly think this does need a nerf in Gold War. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna roll out the gameplay now. 108 kills on Nuketown. Feel free to drop a like if you enjoyed the video at any point in time. And if you are new, we are on the road to 1K subs. We just passed 450, so thank you guys for that. That's gonna be it for me, guys. I hope you enjoy the gameplay and I will catch you in my next gold gun video. Take care. Holy shit, bro.
108 and 24, boys. That was a crazy gameplay. I choked the nuke, but whatever, man. I'll take it. 108 kills. Insane.